Hello, my dear PhD students. I am Professor Dr. Kamal Bhattacharya, uh, Faculty of Arts, Humanities, and Social Sciences. This is uh, a special lecture uh, video for you uh, because. Uh, I have uh, perceived uh, that uh, the scientific conduct in research, uh, I think you need to uh, understand in little um, elaborately, uh, deeply, uh, because this is uh, the uh, your ultimate USP in your research for coming three years. If you understand each and every nuances, if you understand the inherent, uh, inherent uh, peeps of research, then uh, this video will uh, help you out as far as your uh, cognitive uh, concern, cognitive uh, development, knowledge uh, is concerned. Okay. So, in America, you know, America has benefited from creative productive scientific enterprise in which hundreds and thousands of men and women uh, have advanced uh, human knowledge in an environment which is free, open to inquiry and, and societal support and public funding. Remember that scientific conduct needs are associated closely with societal fabrics. As in all uh, such large endeavors, human uh, frailties uh, inevitably appear. We, we, we fail, we, um, we struggle. Okay, it is it is inevitable. You you cannot escape. We cannot escape the errors. Okay, uh, some of them uh, in the form of scientific misconduct, and these errors, knowingly, unknowingly, unwittingly, will come to you, and you have to deal with such uh, things. Uh, with uh, better understanding, because you need a wise uh, spectrum of your uh, uh, understanding, uh, persuasion. Why? Because you cannot escape from the reality, you cannot escape from the reality. Improper conduct can also impede the progress of scientific itself the reduce society's confidence in scientific uh, structure among the researchers. So, again uh, for your understanding scientific conduct does not mean that you have to deal with um, science subjects. Scientific means orderly, proper behavior research, ethics, code of conduct, respect for others, uh, zeal to know, hunch for knowledge, wiseness to, to choose between good and bad correct, incorrect, 
right and wrong so to maintain an uh, to maintain a high standards of scientific uh, conduct okay uh, responsible lies on the researcher participants individual researcher universities and other research institutions professional organizations government they have their own role and you have your own role since 1989 national academy complex in uh, america okay has issued two separate reports one is educational essay uh, that addresses the issues and another the the coming out misconducts which is uh, which are responsible uh, for uh, marring m a r r i n g marring the uh, progress of your research uh, which is uh, very severe and as the technology advances things are easy to retrieve the easy thing makes it complex difficult for researcher in 1992 there was a report responsible science see you know uh, that uh, oppenheimer when he uh, in, in in front of him under under his guidance the first plutonium uh, bomb was exploded and he quoted from the gita the gita that i am the restorer of the human kind he became uh, the another uh, you know prometheus for mankind so questionable research practices which include inappropriate authorship data handling mentorship also require attention by the local officials but are, but are unlikely unlikely when i uh, did my phd so our my guide she was a very uh, erudite personality international uh, erudite personality she was also an emeritus and uh, shakespeare uh, professor i was always uh, on a horns of a dilemma and uh, afraid of producing my writing because uh, never know that uh, what might be what make uh, no, may may crop up or may creep some unscientific or some uh, uh, some misconduct okay from any uh, corner of uh, research uh, periphery so recent uh, uh, decisions uh, by the ugc that uh, has uh, given that uh, the researchers now unlike uh, previous uh, year 
they need not to uh, publish uh, any paper uh, unlike other the uh, arts uh, it was uh, two papers uh, to be published in uh, journals okay this may uh, may reduce uh, your uh, tension level but remember in this university in motherhood university we follow the strict uh, the strictness in 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 investigating the research be it uh, scientific or uh, non scientific uh, papers and we will go definitely for two publications and that will be or might be um, your your uh, that may open your third eye okay that uh, why the need of uh, scientific uh, conduct the follow scientific conducts okay uh, are necessary in uh, research individual researcher the for best safeguard of appropriate scientific conduct lies with the with with the uh, person who is doing the research each of us must insist the truthful reporting remember which is please note it down when you listen to this truthful reporting of the results of experiments and your findings and on the principles of scientific practice and authorship that give proper credit for the origin of the novel ideas and other substantive uh, contributions to research that i in my previous class on saturday uh, friday and saturday i mentioned you that you must have uh, the respect and uh, proper attribution of the writers scientific conduct depends on only one thing that is truthfulness and the public has the right to expect that the valuable res resources that it devotes to scientific conduct will be well used why it is necessary it is necessary because your research is yours when it is within your uh, purview within your laboratory within your uh, copies but when it is published that research is in no longer that belongs to you it belongs to everybody individual researcher have fundamental responsibility to ensure that their results are uh, reproducible reproducible means flexible and it should have an open end that their research is uh, reported thoroughly enough to enable others to reproduce and build on experiments and that significant errors are connected or corrected when they are uh, recognized each and every individual uh, report individual uh, individual individual sentences individual uh, words individual thoughts expressions should be uh, verified should be uh, should be should be uh, responsibly uh, written 
expressed when you are going to publish it. So, there are other uh, departments like uh, the governments are there, the individual universities uh, will be involved, other departments will be there, other, other institutions uh, uh, may be involved in your research. But you have to, if you want your research to be international uh, standard, if you want it to be um, received uh, acclamation uh, from the uh, inter international uh, readership, then you must work, uh, you must uh, uh, act as a pole star, act as a pole star. So, your data collection, your um, your uh, variables and non variables data, your uh, your authorship, your attribution of authorship to others, your uh, you, your uh, taking uh, resources information from others, uh, words and sentences used by you. any any gap that uh, you could not fill up international uh, writings your shortcomings for example uh, if you want to if you are going to uh, do research on uh, the genuinity of uh, Shakespearean uh, writings, whether it is the the man we see as Shakespeare, whether he was uh, a Shakespeare or something else, somebody else, whether he looked like that one. Okay, so this uh, if, if, if you, your shortcomings may be that you do not have those folios. Okay, those folios. Uh, which are which are which are kept in British uh, Museum. You you cannot access it. If you cannot access it, but what you can do in that case, you need to uh, inform the reader, your 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 uh, guide, that you have collected these informations from this, 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 this website which, uh, which uh, have uh, retrieved the information from the British Museum, from the British Library, from the American uh, Library, from a book written in 1916, written in 1914, written in 1898. Your shortcomings will not uh, be a default, not be uh, your drawbacks, but it will, it will give you, uh, it will uh, be assumed by your uh, researcher uh, that whatever you have collected, some of it for 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 literature uh, thesis. Maximum we, we have got the information is second hand information. We read books. We read. Um, we, we we go for uh, different opinions by means of interview. Unlike a scientific uh, research, uh, in scientific research we have got first hand experience and I have a first hand, first hand experiment, first hand experience, first hand information, knowledge that I am learning now on the table. The, the bond, different bond of different molecules, the structure of DNA, the structure of RNA, 
So all these things. But for literature, those who are going for Hindi, the Ritikal, the old um, Hindi uh, literature, the, um, the, the, the literature written by Tulsidas, okay. these are uh, all books are uh, not available to you and you, you cannot read also. Modern research and researchers, they have their uh, own way of uh, or ways of uh, thinking. They have other work to do besides their uh, research. A full uh, bright scholar uh, research in other countries may be a different issue. But in India, I am talking about whatever I am discussing about India and trying to give you uh, a comparable uh, study uh, or difference, not in negative sense, but in positive sense that how you can have your own mentality, make your uh, research uh, standard and uh, successful. Therefore, to uh, come to the conclusion of the gist of the magnet of uh, this video lecture is to make you uh, understand or make you give the sense of research, uh, scientific research conduct is altogether a substantial practice of uh, retrieving information, keeping it giving proper uh, due respect to others, accept uh, opinions, prune opinions by your own understanding, by discussing with your guide. and come to a conclusion which is based on your merit, not guided, not influenced by anybody else. I hope there was uh, a mist a, a haze uh, uh, in front of your eyes regarding this uh, scientific uh, conduct in research. Okay. So, I hope it will a uh, little bit help you to understand the importance and the WH questions, which, what, how, when, where, all these things. Next class we will discuss in little uh, deeper manner. Uh, till then, until then, have a good day and God bless you.